<laughs> so, what we're up to is setting up a frostery water for the pigs since the temperatures are still dropping down in the 20s and garden hoses freeze up, there's just not enough thermal mass to keep it from freezing. <laughs> what we're going to do is take one of the cattle watering tubs and they have a bung that you can replace and I can easily get a plug to put back in. So for right now, all we're going to do is drill it out with a nipple. And then we're going to take the hog nipple that we have usually have set up through a pipe to a garden hose and get plumbed into the bottom of this guy. And once it gets warm enough in a couple weeks, we'll swap it out to the garden hose setup. That way we don't have to worry about filling up or anything else. So looking through, looks like 11 sixteenths. Wood bit is just small enough. We got some good threads on either side. So I'm going to use that to drill out that bung next. So just get like a... All right, Roger, ready to drill this thing? We're going to make ourselves a pig water. Step back a little bit. self-sealing so go ahead and thread it in see how it does ideally if i was going cheap we would use the 50 gallon drum but everything around here 50 gallon drums is as good as used for maple syrup so not turning it into a pig water so paulus actually had a great idea uh, why don't we use something like the chick brooder aka only short stock tanks and that's a brilliant idea. Now, looks like we're going to have to tighten the bung up to get that to seal up. That's not what we need to do. Again, yeah, about of course one good idea. Of course, I'm going to try to do that way. screwdriver? What'd you do with the one you had? Oh, you did put your bike in here. Here you go, buddy. All right, that's a square plug. The only thing that has to be tightened up is on the outside. All right, so I believe there's a... You're gonna need a pipe wrench probably to tighten that. Uh, should be oh, one right in there. Yeah. I think it's in that blue tub has a pipe wrench in it. A really big one. Yep, awesome. So, not the prettiest job. Threads look nice and tight. Get the bung to tighten up, and I think we'll be in business. We'll wash this out really good. I think to get it high enough so they don't to be on the ground to do it we'll set this on a pallet and we'll be in business one flexible temperature water built place this bung we're right back in business with the cows Get it set up and we'll bring you guys back and see how it works. 